Oh my gosh. Ladies and gentlemen, what is happening to Bitcoin right now as we speak? We have just dumped almost at least 60% off of our high. Oh my gosh. This is just crazy right now, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for tuning in. Welcome back to Crypto Takeover. We make a Bitcoin video every single day on this channel. We've been killing it in our calls lately. My team is up over a large number of percent right now. Uh, we're going to take a look to see what is going on right now, what is being said. My team is just constantly putting in profit logs for us in our crypto takeover team, team takeover. Shout out to y'all for killing it out there. Y'all been paying attention to me when everyone else hasn't, when we get all these <laughs> people on here telling me I have crappy thumbnails. All right. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. Is this due to coronavirus? I have no idea, but we're going to take a look at the charts and see what the charts are telling us. And we're just going to go with the flow because um, what can we do? What can, what can a crypto investor do uh, to hedge against these markets besides put in a freaking short? So that's what we've been doing on this channel, y'all. And we've been totally killing it. And uh, we're going to take a look at the charts to see what they're telling us, if, if this is going to last or not, if this is sustainable. Uh, are, are we uh, getting ready to go back to 3,500? Are we going to bounce back up from here? And we're going to head up to 100K right now, maybe by tomorrow. I don't know, man. Moon boys will say anything, you know, but Doom boys will also say a lot of things too. So we're just going to take a look at the charts to see what they're telling us. We keep it pretty... Uh, you know, we, we try to stay, uh, you know, on both sides or just to see what's happening in the market. So like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that way y'all can be updated every time CTO makes a freaking video on this channel. So let's get into it. All right, so we are just constantly bouncing around right now, and uh, we recently had this major, major drop off here. Uh, broke through one of our Fib channels that I thought we were going to get support at about 7100. I told my group about 7100. Hey, go ahead, take your profit there. We'll probably get support. Man, we straight broke through that 618, and we are at that bottom Fib level now. So. We are currently kind of holding support at that bottom fib. Is it going to hold or not? We broke a two-year, uh, not even a two-year, I think it was almost a five-year resistance line or support line for Bitcoin um, over over the night, past couple of hours, going into the morning. Uh, so what are the charts telling us? Let's kind of zoom out on the charts a little bit. We can see our money flow is still heavily trending into the red here. Bitcoin looking for maybe some consolidation right about now. We'll see if it's going to last or not. We're going to keep looking at the charts. 30 minute, still heavily in the money flow, constantly putting in big green dots for us, but no sign of reversal just yet. 45 minute, almost looking about the exact same, putting in big green dot down here, looking for some consolidation as of right now. One hour, same money flow is still trending heavily or it's starting to move more into the red just a tad bit so here's here's where we got in at y'all uh I, I was looking at our 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 one hour red money flow for the longest time and i was like okay I, I want this to turn green so that way it can do whatever it needs to do if it needs to do this little scam pump to the top side it can do its little scam pump to the top side and then we can take our short from there well um our one hour wasn't really giving us that green money flow. And yesterday we were, I was out and uh, we were waiting for the call. My group was waiting for the call. Uh, CTO, what's, what's going on? CTO, CTO. Oh man, you've been making great calls. Da, 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 da. You've, been doing, you've been doing your thing. You've been doing your thing. Da, 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 da. You've, been, you've been helping us out. Uh, we, we were all doing the wrong thing at the wrong time. And I'm like, all right, guys, so hold on. Sit tight, sit tight. I'm waiting for one time frame to line up for us. I was waiting on the one hour to line up for us. And I never got the one hour into our green money flow just yet. But I said, hey, this right here was just consolidating out into our red. And we never quite got that green money flow. I said, hey, guys, um, things had already started to dump off just a tad bit. I think this is where we had that yellow X right here. Um, and we were testing this FIB, FIB channel once again. I said, hey, guys, 
find a position. Let's go ahead and take it. Let's go ahead and get in because I don't think we're going to get that green money flow that we wanted to on our one hour. And I think we're just going to, we need to get in right now. So I told him, I said, hey, let's get in right here. And so we got in at about, yeah, I say about 7,800, 7,600-ish area. Um, and uh, <laughs> we were ready, okay? So we started to pump a little bit to the top side just to get those orders filled or whatever. I wasn't, no fret, you know, I wasn't, I was just, Keeping calm, keeping calm. Everyone on my team, they're like, no, CTO's, CTO's calling for these numbers. CTO's calling for these numbers. Just wait, just wait. I said, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, we got this, we got this. So boom, um, get get on in a few hours. I start to see the dump happening. Okay, cool. Um, it's looking like it's gonna line up for us, right? We start to break through our FIB channel at the uh, 0.5, ready to head to the 618. A couple hours later, oh, okay, boom, yeah. Oh, we're down there, okay. Um, in profit everyone's in profit at this time we're like yeah cto dang you nailed it again blah 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 i'm like hey guys you know i'm just doing my thing for y'all you know like i don't know the charts tell me what they're telling me you know we get a great indicator um we got great groups in our um you know i'm, I'm a part of some really great groups that have taught me a lot too as well but i feel like it just wasn't enough due diligence for myself so i needed to take the time out for myself do my own due diligence for the market and decide what was going to happen for myself here and that's when i decided to say hey i'm going to start making a channel i want to uh go over my charts every single day just to see what's happening and we have been totally just like nailing it um these shorts have been uh freaking awesome for me and my group they've profited so much from this but it's also a reason why I want to keep the group so small is because there's not a lot of noise in there and I don't want there to be a lot of noise. So that's why there is a cap on the private signals group if you go check that out. But there is a cap on there. We're going to keep it at that cap and um, I'm only going to allow so many people into the group with me. So if y'all are interested in that, y'all can go check it out. Um, let's see here. But also I have the weekly newsletter that I send out too as well. So I'll be sending a newsletter out probably uh, in the next few days uh, just to tell y'all how I was able to get this call so perfectly right um, to the downside here. Um, when, you know, CF and everyone else, they were staying out of the market. They weren't in a short, da 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 da, -da this and that. Uh, like I saw this coming even before that long that, you know, CF was talking about, I was kind of like, eh, I don't know about that, man. Y'all need to be careful, you know? And so, uh, yeah, and we just totally are killing it on here. So feel free to sign up for the newsletter. I do giveaways on there every once in a while too. Uh, y'all can make sure y'all become a part of that to qualify. You need to be signed up for the newsletter. <clears throat> then also the Patreon page, this is where you get signed up to become my VIP private signal uh, group member in the Patreon page. So there are two different tiers. You can um, either just get the Patreon posts, which in the Patreon posts, I give you my two favorite altcoins that I am in heavy, heavy accumulation of as of right now. One of them could even flip the market cap of Bitcoin. As you can see, Bitcoin, I think, is um, is being compromised as of right now, to, to say the least. So, uh, you know, I think that this altcoin that I have listed in here will definitely cap the market of Bitcoin eventually sometime soon. Uh, maybe even after the happening or in the next couple of years. But then also I give you trading strategies in there. I tell you how I set up my market cipher, how it's my custom setup with uh, market cipher, my uh, buy, whales buy sell signal, uh, and then also the Aldo EMAs, which are key in indicators for uh, trading and learning how to price target. And I give you all those strategies in my Patreon page as well. But then also if you want to get the VIP private signals, uh, access you're going to need to sign up for that second tier on there so make sure that y'all join us in team takeover we are currently using discord so y'all can join the discord server if y'all like but the private channel in there for for my patreon members only is where you'll get the um, signals at and then also the telegram group is uh constantly getting uh getting going so i hope that y'all are joining me on there uh <laughs> we I was up last night and I saw that, uh, you know, this new announcement of the coronavirus being a, a pandemic now, uh, they raised it to a pandemic. Trump said uh, Europeans are not allowed to travel right now either. And that's when we started to see this, a little bit of this sell off too as well. So I was keeping my Telegram group members up today. I said, hey, hey man, <laughs> 
we're we're in this uh, private signals group and we're doing really really well right now. Um, and then that news came out just a tad bit later, and I said, oh, okay, so this is what it's all about. It's really crazy, y'all. It's really interesting how looking at the charts, <laughs> I'm not freaking out whatsoever. That's the thing. Uh, like, I'm mentally prepared because I had this knowledge beforehand. I had the knowledge beforehand because I studied the charts over and over and over again, right? And I could see something coming, see something brewing, and I'm not freaking out right now. I'm not panicking. I'm not depressed. You know, like, you know, sometimes we, we, we get inside our heads too much, you know, and I get it. I get it. I get it. You know, it, it's, we, we can do it. We can only do what we can do, right? But at the same time, if you can get one edge against the market and just be ready for something that might occur, then, hey, if you can do that, we can do that, you know. So uh, I feel like we are accomplishing a little bit about that. And everyone in my Patreon uh, private signals group as well uh, is just really appreciative of everything. And I'm really appreciative of them, too. So I'll give them a shout out here at the end of the video. We can see here on our four hour also just not even quite into that red money flow just yet. Uh, I mean, you know, it's not, uh, it's getting bigger where it should be at, uh, getting ready to put in maybe another big green dot there as well. Our six hour, same here. We see our yellow X's popping up left and right here. Our uh, six hour, maybe looking for a big green dot down there as well. Eight hour, we're just, we're going to get pushed. Uh, you know, I don't, I, it's so weird coming on YouTube and then sometimes, you know, uh, I, I notice I get some of these, you know, dislikes, but I'm really just going by what the charts are saying and, and I'm not really using fundamentals on this, uh, this YouTube channel either. So I think that people that were so cued in on fundamentals beforehand, you know, come to channels that can get kind of bearish and they tend to show a lot of hate towards them as well too. But honestly, I feel like I was stuck in that like paradigm of fundamentals, fundamentals, the fundamentals are saying this, the hash rate is saying this, da 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 da, stock to flow saying this, da 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 da. And I I think that, that I think that that's just a mind a mindset trap, to be honest. So what we're doing on here is just looking at straight straight charts and uh, I feel a little bit safer about that now to be honest. So we can see in our eight hour we're still just kind of trending into that money flow as well. As we go into our 12 hour, can kind of see the same thing, looking for another big green dot. Money flow is just now turning into the red here on our 12 hour as well. So if we go into here, we can see that I also use TradingView Pro Plus plan. If y'all are interested in using TradingView Pro Plus, please use the link in the description box below. Market Cipher allows me to, uh, well, I use Market Cipher, but then I use a few other uh, signals on there as well. And Pro Plus allows me to have five indicators on the screen. So feel free to check that out. Uh, I use the Ledger Nano S or X. If y'all are interested, uh, use the link in the description box below. If your overall strategy is to just hodl, you're definitely going to want this. Even if you're trading too, you're going to want to, you're going to want a cold storage device as well. So right now, I think if you buy a Ledger Nano X, you get a free Ledger Nano S2. So help support the channel. We use Bybit. Uh, most of my team uses the Bybit uh, platform as well, but please use the test net before you get started. Uh, get signed up with the link in the description box and then ask chat how to access the test net and you'll be able to, um, trade fake BTC to make sure you're a profitable trader, then you can actually deposit your actual Bitcoin on there later on. If you're a USA citizen, you can leverage trade using Prime XBT. You can leverage trade the S&P 500. Dude, this would have been such a nice market to short the S&P 500 as well too. I mean, uh, <laughs> I don't even want to look at that chart right now. I'll look at it later, but usually I'll give my Patreon some alt altcoin charts as well if they have any requests. So, um, but yeah, you can leverage trade all using BTC, gold and silver. You can leverage trade uh, um, some of your fiat currencies as well, all using Bitcoin. So check that out. I use the Brave browser to browse the web. I'm getting paid out in BAT token every single month to browse the web using the Brave browser. Check that link down in the description box below. Uh, and Brave browser is literally the next, next wave or the next browser <laughs> of the future. So check that out for sure. Uh, I also use CryptoTab browser to mine Bitcoin straight from my uh, straight from my computer. So I have it running on two different older 
laptops I don't really use anymore. I just use it as a background process for them. And then also you can use it on your phone or your tablets, your old phone or tablets that you don't use anymore either, if this is gonna load up. So as you can see, I, I can mine Bitcoin straight from here without the trouble of having an ASIC miner or ant miner set up. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter as well. Message me on Discord if you're interested. I thought this was kind of funny. This was a coronavirus. It like takes out the stock markets. Stock market, healthcare, crude oil. Let's see if I can turn the volume here. Let's see if this works. Coronavirus pops out, pops out of nowhere. I don't know if it's gonna run for me, but anywho, uh, just follow. Yeah, follow me on those pages if y'all are interested. I post some funny memes sometimes on my Twitter page as well. I follow a lot of the major guys on Twitter too, um, but but yeah, feel free to hit me up on there if you'd like. So we're gonna finish off the charts here. Our 12 hour uh, still looking like the money flow is just now moving into that red area, just giving us a glimpse of what is to come possibly. Um, same with our our daily. Money flow is just now moving into the red. This could get pretty interesting, to be honest. Look at this huge wick down here. I mean, just just wild, just wild. <laughs> we're gonna see how this day closes off to see if uh, we're gonna still see some of these lower prices or if that was just a huge wick that that's gonna give us our three day. Also the same thing. I mean, we literally just stopped right at that FIP support channel. So quite interesting that I drew this FIB support. I don't think I've seen anyone else draw this uh, FIB channel out before. So I thought it was kind of interesting to draw out. We did break our two year support line, or this was like five year support line. I think this went all the way back into our last, going into our last uh, bull market as well. So breaking through that, are we gonna close? It looks like we're closing below it as well. I'm gonna actually just turn on our regular candles just to see what's happening here. Ooh, man, look at, oof, wow. Okay, our regular candles look even worse. <laughs> man, okay, that is freaking wild, man. <laughs> yeah, and <laughs> yeah, it's just it's just being being prepared, being ready, so. That's our one day, our three day is looking about the same. Five day, uh, still looking like we have some bearish momentum here on our five day as well too, once this loads up for us. So yeah, very, very interesting stuff, y'all. But all we can do is just be prepared out there for anything that's to come. Uh, I think my team is definitely ready for what is to come. They're always, um, showing their support to me and I just want to give I'll give a shout out to them to finish it off we can see our six day our weekly all getting our cell signals too as well indicating that we had something major about to happen and we were there for it we were there we were ready for it we took we took precaution uh ew, man this monthly is just oof wow we're if we break below our 21 EMA on our monthly uh, I think we've actually already have, to be honest, if I go to our regular candles. Yep, we're, we're testing our 50, our 50 monthly support, our 50 EMA monthly support with the blood diamond on our monthly. Woo, man. Oh, oh my. Oh, my. Oh, me. Oh, my. <laughs> this, uh, hey, I'm just, don't, I'm just going by what the charts are telling me, you know, so monthly blood diamond, that, that is freaking interesting so we're gonna have to wait till the end of the month to see if this closes out or not i'm gonna be relatively busy going on into this weekend into the next weekend i'm actually um taking time out to do a um a a, a, a training course but not not for crypto stuff related it's for uh fitness stuff related and and with that being said uh i, I so i'm gonna be teaching a couple of fitness classes on the side or whatever but with that being said, we need, to be out, we need to be out there taking care of our bodies. If We need to take care of our bodies through this time because uh, we know that immune systems, if they're weak right now, they're susceptible to um, this influenza virus that is going around. Uh, so we just need to be ready for whatever, making sure that our bodies are staying nice and strong through these times right now. So 
trading view is just taking forever to load up right now. But yeah, I'm going to be relatively busy. I'm still going to try and push a video out every day. I'm still going to take care of my Patreon members as well. If we go into our weekly, we are breaking uh, 100 EMA support, 200 EMA support. Is right down here as well. Sorry about that. Alarms are going off. But hey, me and the team, we're feeling good. We're having fun right now. We are, we, we are feeling real good. So shout out to them. Let me, let me do the quick shout out real quick. I was just, I did want to look. I'm still like, oh man, like where, where is, where could bottom be at right now? I'm, I just don't know. <laughs> I mean, I think we went all the way to 5,600 to be honest, uh, on Bybit right now. I'm looking at Bybit. I'm like 5,600. Okay. Yeah. And that looks like we touched about 5,700 ish area, but I'm just, I'm just in shock, man. Like this 200 simple moving average is another one that we've been kind of eyeing out is about that 4,800, 4,500-ish area as well. More than likely going to get this death cross too. Um, man, I don't, I don't know what to say right now, but uh, I, think, I think we'll be fine. Hey, we'll be fine, y'all, because if our head just is short, then like, hey, we got the properties, we got the tools to do it, so might as well go in and do it. Uh, yeah, kind of curious just how this, this weekly – uh, weekly definitely broke through the 21 EMA. I do want to kind of look back at this monthly real quick to see when the last time we broke through our monthly 21 EMA was and what happened there. And this is what happened when we broke through our 21 EMA as well. We found support on our 50 EMA. And right now we're kind of finding support here at our 50 EMA on our monthly as well. So uh, get ready. We're in for a, a, a ride. So we'll see what happens. Please like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that we all can be updated every single video that I make on this channel. This is Crypto Takeover coming back with another freaking spot on uh, trade call with my group too as well. Uh, let me shout them out real quick. Let me see if I can get them on here. So shout out to them, Antonio G, Azmithril, BTC Punisher, Dan, Fly Eagle, Greg, Hanus, Harold W, Haru Yor, uh, Jimmy A, Palak, Jonah, James A. Hunter, Muhammad, Nick, August, Dogensoy, Oscar, P. Wright, Paul A. Keller, Pike 379, Prestige 39, Shane Stein, Tall Troy, Tim Luna, Unique Object, Van Life 177. Uh, totally just killing it. Um, Check out the profit logs, man. Check out the profit logs. We we are we are taking profit. Check out the profit logs. That's all y'all need to see. All right. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. I'll talk to y'all in the next one. Stay safe out there. This weekend's going to be interesting going on into next week. Be safe. Talk to y'all then.